So Logic has officially met my son. Yes. That's the homie right there, DJ Mini Matt. Um, I don't know why he's here. Why did you guys bring him here? He's meeting. He's a very sweet boy though. <laughs> he's just waiting for Justine to come back. What kind of camera is it? It's a G7X. You need to grab it. Wait, let's let's, let's get the, the good side. lighting. Well, Look, don't get this. Holding it. Hold okay. On. This oh, my wife has this one. Yeah, no, and the, the second edition is actually coming out in like two weeks. Yeah. Nice. Flat. So, what is, what's it, the it's, uh, it's just better, like faster, like autofocus and just better everything, I guess. Yeah. I would imagine oh, so. Sorry. I'm here with the homies. We got Logic, uh, typical gamer, his boy. We're at the YouTube space. They're just kind of like, I don't know what I'm actually specifically doing here, <laughs> but we're just Hang chilling. Out, yeah, we're Having just hanging out, time. being friends. We're gonna go get street tacos at this, right? Oh, yeah. If I'm you down. guys are, if you guys are actually about that, I'm starving. Love to get some street tacos. <laughs> I just Whoa. picked up a singles too, a thousand dollars in singles nice. for a video what? yesterday. It's Perfect. great. Wait, I will tell you guys all about it. Okay. I've come to join them. Yeah. Oh, bro. I thought I was gonna bomb it for a second, You're... but then you like shut it off. Well, I was trying to speed it up because the waiter waitress was here, and I didn't want to like mess it up. Like I didn't want her to feel uncomfortable because I have a camera oh, she on. Left. She left. Yeah. And she right. didn't know what I was doing. Should wait. So wait. Do you think I should like start vlogging for my gaming channel? Oh, 100 million percent, everything bro. Everything I've been doing has just been. Do it all. Gaming. I don't know. I, I, nah. Do it. We can do whatever you want. Do it channel. all, bro. Whatever you like want. the people, the Rat Pack. They love that shit. Yeah. Okay. Then let it be known that it's because of Nate here that. Bro, I'm gonna start vlog 100 million. They would love it, bro. I'm gonna start fucking doing it, bro. <laughs> yeah, cool. They're gonna love it, dude. 100. percent All right, he's he's uh. I'll put his channel in the description below. Go subscribe. Logic's gonna start vlogging. You heard right, it here nice. first. You have to shout me out. I got you, bro. <laughs>today baby woo going on a road trip i am very very excited traffic in la is no joke man everyone's always complaining about it they've got a valid reason to complain man i made it i don't i've actually i've been driving a lot around this time it's it's like 10 a.m i don't think i've ever dealt with traffic that badly uh in a long long time i don't know what is so weird or special about today but that was awful we're gonna get on our way to vegas here really soon uh of course waiting on justine nothing new i mean i'm late i'm an hour late so that can give you some context as to how late justine actually is look at this look at this oh my god oh my god there are so many cops Holy crap, is the president in town? Do you think it's a police escort? What's going on? Look at this. It's just cop after cop after cop. What is happening? Wow. Dude, that's insane. That's a lot of them. I wonder what happened. Do you think something's going down? I don't know. Let's, let's turn Well, it's good that we're going the opposite, opposite way. Oh my god. I've never seen that many cops in my life. Me either. Undercover cops? I've literally Whoa. never never seen anything like that in my life before either. Holy Dude, that, there had to be at least 30 cops. 30 cop than cars that. there. That's more than that. Yeah. That was like 100. That, that was like unbelievable. I've never seen anything like that in my entire life. There's even oh more cops. God. There's even more. There's more and more and more. Oh my gosh. This is unreal. Unfortunately, we know what happened. So right now, as we speak, there is a shooting going down at UCLA, which is a college out here. And apparently there's two confirmed victims already and the school's on lockdown. Mm -hmm. So we think all of these cars and all these cops, which even more drove by, it had to be at least like 35 or 40 of them, 50 of them maybe. Individual cars are going there to handle the situation, I would presume. So got our thoughts for everyone at campus that sucks i can't even imagine so we're on our way to vegas still what they have on their hands and they have so many places that an individual or individuals could hide could go potentially could cause more cause more uh, you know situations they're bringing everybody in they can because there's such a massive area here to go through in fact it's right next to the ronald reagan medical center ucla on this late may day in the very crowded section of los angeles So I got this letter from Activision yesterday and it told me not to open it until today. Of course, I'm not gonna listen to that. You can't send me something and then tell me I can't open it until tomorrow. Like, it's not like this thing was gonna self-destruct if I opened it 12 hours early. So I opened it up and it is an invite to Call of Duty XP 2016 and they have made all types of announcements today about this event. If you guys didn't know, 
really kind of like the start of me making Call of Duty career was actually Call of Duty XP in 2011. We won the tournament, we got first place, we all got to take home $100,000 each. And for me, I used that money so that I can actually move out of my parents' house, drop out of college, and try and make YouTube and streaming and just competitive Call of Duty a dream of mine. And as you guys know, today, it ended up panning out for me. So that's why I'm incredibly excited about this event because this could be the start of the same road that I went on for another player who wants to do the same thing that I'm doing today. So this is gonna be a three day event in Los Angeles, California at the Forum and they said that they're gonna have like a $2 million prize pool. So that's actually pretty insane. GG Activision, thank you very much for the invite. I will be at the event, I will not be playing. Unfortunately for me, it's not in the new Call of Duty like Modern Warfare 3 was in 2011 at Call of Duty XP because at that time we were playing Black Ops 1 but the actual tournament was played on Modern Warfare 3. So nobody really knew the game. It didn't matter how good you were at Black Ops 1. It just was dependent on how well you picked up a new game and that's sort of my strong suit. I'm always really, really good at the beginning and then I kind of trail off towards the end when everybody catches up. But uh, for somebody, Black Ops 3 is gonna make them a lot, a lot of money for a competitive player and I'm really excited for that. But before I show you guys anything else, I kinda wanna just have a chat, a one-on-one, -on -one, because a lot of things have been happening, a lot of things have been swirling around my mind what I wanna do with this YouTube channel because for me, sometimes it's really, really hard to think of a new video to upload. And I've been talking about that the last couple weeks. You guys have probably heard me talk about that a few times, so I apologize if it sounds like a revolving door that I keep coming back to the same topic. The other day, I was inspired by a few channels that I was watching. Obviously, Casey Neistat, obviously Obviously Tom Syndicate and then this new guy named Mars Bar Gaming he does like daily vlogs and they're just phenomenal so I was watching his videos last night and I was like listen I'm going to buy the same camera and I want to do something similar to that I just thought it was so cool how he told stories in his videos and how well he actually did it I don't really watch many YouTube videos I really don't and so when I went through a few of his videos I just kept watching because one they were really really well edited Two, like I said he told the story very very well and three just the quality of his videos with the equipment that he was using which is fantastic so I've really been toying around with the idea of starting to daily vlog you know I've always been against it because I just feel like I might not do a lot of things that are too interesting and sometimes a lot of these people that are daily vlogging are doing really really cool stuff but I think I want to make a point of it to do some really cool stuff get me out of the house and have the camera on me so We'll see, I really wanna know what you guys think about the idea of daily vlogging. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. I'm not trying to turn into another vlogging channel. Like, it's not really my goal. I'm not trying to like copy the swagger because I actually started doing real life videos back in the Optic House. And I think that was kind of like the start of people doing real life videos in the world of gaming. I was doing like these days in the life. It was, it was called day in the life and I, I didn't invent the term day in the life. Other people had done it on YouTube before. But Day in the Life started for me when I was living at the Optic House and then obviously fast forward like a year and a half later and every single person in gaming is really doing these daily vlogging videos. So I'm not sure. I kind of want to try it out because like the next couple weeks are going to be really busy. I've got everybody coming in for Anaheim tomorrow and then I've got everybody coming in for E3 which is in a week and then I have an entire couple weeks where Jenna's not going to be here. I think I might go out to the Phase House. I want to go out to the Optic House. So it might be really, really fun. I'm really excited about it. I just want you guys to let me know what you guys think. 